Hello! This video is part of the paid forward prize hub. You could win a prize at each stop, so take a look at the description to see the list of the video you have to watch to win. For my part, I will offer uh, to someone a tree set of Team Old stamps. So please let me a comment and uh, I will pick one to win this prize. I started with three vanilla tag and a stamp with the USA map on it. So I just apply uh, black ink on the stamp and stamp part of, of it on the tag. Next, I apply Distress Oxide ink by Tim Holtz. This one is Firebreak. And I also use the faded jeans. Reveal the oxide look, you need to apply water, so I just spray some on my tag. I decided it needs some more ink, so I just apply again and spray water again. If you want to stamp with this platform, you have to look if your uh, acrylic block is on the rubber or acrylic side. Mine was on acrylic, so I just reverse it to have uh, the rubber side on. So I use the stars in the USA title and I will cut it to make my embellishment. Now I'm coloring the stars with the red fire brick. Um, I'm just using directly the ink with the watercolor pen. coloring the title and I'm using different color for each letter. The U is in red, the A will be in blue and for the S I will use another color. I used for the S is the vintage photo with a little bit more uh, water than the other color. It's time for fussy cutting. If you follow me on my blog or uh, on my other video, you have seen that I love fussy cutting. So I just cut every stars and every letter to make my embellishment. that all is cut. I'm using a white gel pen to draw some stars, very, very tiny stars on the blue part of the tag uh, to mimic the stars on the, the American flag. And now I draw some lines like on the the American flag. 
some line with the black pen to uh, outline the tag. Before this video, I just cut some letter uh, into vanilla cardstock, so I made uh, a pride word with it. I'm using again the vintage photo distress oxide to add a vintage look to the letter. And I'm outlining uh, this letter with the black pen. I wanted my embellishment to pop a little bit from the tag, so I just cut some uh, 3D foam double side adhesive to fit the stars and the letter. I did repeat each step on each tag, so I got a set of three tags for the 4th of July. And uh, now, if you want to play in the harp, you have to leave a comment on this video to be able to enter the, the giveaway. I hope you like this tag and uh, be sure to follow the instruction in the detail of the video. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.